Hey, everyone, welcome back to the channel, where we keep you up to date on all the latest celebrity news and gossip. And let me tell you, today's story is a juicy one. We're talking about the renewed connection between Jennifer Garner and Ben Affleck. Yes, these two have been spending a lot of time together lately, and it's stirring up some major concerns from Jennifer's boyfriend, John Miller. Trust me, you're going to want to stick around for this because things are getting real interesting. Before we dive in, make sure to hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications so you'll be the first to know when we drop more content just like this. Alright, let's jump right into the details. So, what's really going on with Jennifer Garner and Ben Affleck? It seems like these two have been inseparable lately, and the media is buzzing about their frequent meetups. Now, before we get ahead of ourselves, let's get one thing clear, Jennifer and Ben have always maintained a close relationship for the sake of their three kids. That's no secret. They've always put their children first, co-parenting like pros and keeping things civil despite their divorce. But recently, it looks like the lines between co-parenting and something more have started to blur, and people are beginning to talk. The question on everyone's mind is, is this just a friendly co-parenting situation, or is something more happening behind the scenes? And what does Jennifer's boyfriend, John Miller, think about all of this? If you've been paying attention, you'll know that John Miller is a very private individual, who has managed to stay out of the media frenzy that often surrounds Jennifer and Ben. But even someone as laid back as John is starting to feel the pressure of this complicated situation. Over the past few months, Jennifer Garner and Ben Affleck have been spotted together more frequently than usual. From casual lunches in their Brentwood neighborhood to showing up at events together for their kids, it seems like the two are spending a lot more time together. One of the biggest headlines came just a few weeks ago when Jennifer and Ben were photographed laughing and chatting at their son Samuel's basketball game. The photos quickly went viral, and fans couldn't help but speculate, was this just another co-parenting moment, or was there something deeper going on? It didn't stop there. Just days later, Jennifer and Ben were seen out at a local coffee shop, looking relaxed and comfortable in each other's presence. While the two have always been seen together for family-related activities, these non-co-parenting outings are raising eyebrows. Even Hollywood insiders are beginning to question whether this renewed closeness might be leading somewhere unexpected. But with Ben's relationship with Jennifer Lopez going through some noticeable ups and downs, it's hard not to wonder if he's turning to his ex-wife Jennifer Garner for comfort. Could Ben be seeking solace from Jennifer during a turbulent time in his life? After all, they share years of history, a deep bond, and three kids together, so it wouldn't be surprising if Ben finds emotional support in Jennifer. But what does that mean for John Miller, the man Jennifer has been in a serious relationship with for a while now? Let's talk about John Miller for a minute. As we all know, Jennifer Garner has been dating John Miller, the CEO of Cali Group, a tech company that operates Caliburger and focuses on AI-driven technology. John's low-key lifestyle is worlds apart from the Hollywood chaos Jennifer's ex-husband Ben Affleck is familiar with. That's part of why Jennifer and John's relationship has worked so well, he offers her a sense of stability, privacy, and peace. Unlike the media whirlwind that constantly follows Jennifer and Ben, John keeps his life away from the public eye, and he's happy to do so. But now, with Jennifer spending more time with Ben, it's no wonder John Miller is starting to feel uneasy. According to sources close to the couple, John is getting increasingly worried about the renewed closeness between Jennifer and Ben. While he understands that they need to co-parent, John reportedly feels like Jennifer's relationship with Ben is taking up more space in their lives than he's comfortable with. Friends of John have said that he's starting to question how much emotional energy Jennifer is investing in her relationship with Ben, especially given Ben's ongoing issues, including his recent public struggles with mental health and personal matters. John has always been the supportive boyfriend, but even the most patient person would feel uncomfortable seeing their significant other get so close to an ex, especially one as high-profile and emotionally connected as Ben. The concern isn't just about physical time spent together. From what insiders are saying, it's the emotional bond that Jennifer and Ben share that seems to be causing the most strain. Despite being divorced for years, their deep connection as co-parents and friends is undeniable. 
John has been trying to remain supportive, but it's becoming clear that Ben's increasing presence in Jennifer's life is creating tension behind the scenes. So where does Jennifer Garner stand in all of this? Well, Jennifer is known for her ability to juggle a lot, and she's no stranger to managing complicated relationships. As a devoted mom, she's always put her kids first, making sure they have a stable, loving environment, even after her divorce from Ben. She's been open about the challenges of co-parenting, but she's also proud of how far she and Ben have come in creating a peaceful dynamic for their children. But managing her relationship with John Miller while keeping things smooth with Ben Affleck might be one of Jennifer's toughest challenges yet. She's always valued her relationship with John, and sources close to her say she's very committed to making things work. However, the strain of balancing the past and present is reportedly weighing on her. It's a delicate balance to maintain, how do you continue being a supportive co-parent and a present partner in your romantic relationship without crossing boundaries? It's clear that Jennifer wants the best for her family, but sources suggest that she's becoming more aware of how her relationship with Ben might be impacting her future with John. There are whispers that Jennifer has been spending more time reflecting on where she stands with both men, and that she's doing her best to make sure everyone involved feels secure. Of course, the public and media are having a field day with this story. Some tabloids have gone as far as to suggest that Jennifer and Ben might be heading toward a full-blown reconciliation, especially with the ongoing rumors about Ben's shaky relationship with Jennifer Lopez. While that theory is largely speculation, it's hard to ignore the growing chemistry between the two exes. But there's another camp of people who believe that Jennifer Garner is fully committed to John Miller and that these outings with Ben are nothing more than innocent co-parenting moments. After all, she's always made it clear that her kids come first, and if spending time with Ben is what's best for them, then she'll do it. The question is, will John Miller be able to accept this and trust that nothing more is happening behind the scenes? So, where does this leave us? Will Jennifer and Ben's rekindled friendship continue to cause friction between her and John? Or will Jennifer find a way to maintain peace and balance between both important men in her life? It's hard to say, but one thing is clear, the stakes are higher than ever. Well, that's the story, folks. Jennifer Garner and Ben Affleck are reunited again, and it's clear that her boyfriend John Miller has some major concerns. What do you think? Is it all just innocent co-parenting, or is there something deeper going on between Jen and Ben? Drop your thoughts in the comments below because we want to hear from you. And don't forget, if you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up and smash that subscribe button for more celebrity updates just like this. Turn on notifications so you never miss out on the latest news and gossip. Thanks so much for watching, and we'll catch you next time.